nama bali papam that means committing sin by the strength of chanting holy name ek krishna naam kori sarva papam kheyo sadin sastra one name krishna is so potential that it can destroy innumerable sins accumulated from lakhs of lives so potential one name of krishna ek krishna naam kori sarva papam kheyo if someone says or thinks Oh, this is a very good weapon I have gotten now. I will chant Hare Krishna and destroy all sinful reactions. Then I will commit some new sins, then I will again chant Hare Krishna and destroy it. This mentality is Nama Vale Papa Buddhi. That means committing sins and strength of chanting Hare Nama. This is an offense once you have developed such mentality. Those who are now accepting one of a guru and being initiated by him, taking Harinam, they should not in thought, in mind, think of any sin. One should be very careful, though in Kali Juba, there is a concession, that in Kali Juba, by thinking of sinful activity or sinful engagements in mind, one will not get sinful reactions unless he executes the sin. In the college of if someone in the mind just thinks that I must accept a Bonaparte spiritual master, guru, and take Harinam from him, just by thinking he gets good results. Krishna is seated as Paramatma, super soul, in the heart. Immediately starts to shower mercy on him. Such a good result is there. Only by mere thinking, but to speak of performing or executing. But those who are initiated, are taking initiation, they should be very, very careful not to think of anything sinful in the mind. Of course, the mind is very wicked, very wicked. Unconsciously, it thinks something. But one should take it seriously that henceforth, from this moment, I shall not allow the wicked mind to think anything sinful. Should not. And how serious is he? How has he really developed faith in the holy name, Krishna, who is there in the heart as Paramatma? He knows. He knows the heart. This is the most important thing. If there is nothing in the heart but consciously enters into the mind, immediately he becomes conscious. Oh, this wicked mind does such nonsense. Immediately chants. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Krishna Hare Hare, Hare Rama, Hare Rama, Rama Rama, 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 Hare Hare. And from the core of his heart, ah, the Krishna, the holy name, to excuse him. He is excused, but it should not be done repeatedly. You understand what I say? Let me say one thing more in this respect. Those who are not devotees are sadhus. And those who are hypocrites, outwardly posing as devotees are Vaishnavas. But inside they are not so. They are hypocrites, cheaters. By the association of such persons, this thing takes place. You understand? By the association of such persons, such cheaters, such hypocrites, those outwardly posing Vaishnavas are Bhakta, chanting Hare Krishna also. But inwardly they are not so. They are cheaters, they are hypocrites. Do you understand? By the assistance of such persons, this thing takes place. That the thought of sinful activity enters into the mind. If someone will be careful in this regard, not to associate with such a person, which will enable him to commit such an offense, may avoid such an offense, otherwise it is very difficult. 